On Tuesday, May 1st, Hopkins and Hillers softball took on Westwood in their home opener. The Hillers put up three runs in the first inning. And there is ball four. That is going to drive in a run for the Hillers. Emily Whalen comes around from third to score, and it's one to nothing Hopkinton. And that is going to be a walk to Jordan Chevery. Excuse me for the mispronunciation there. It was spelled wrong. And that'll drive in another Hiller's run as Alyssa McIntyre comes around to score. Jordan Chevery at second, or excuse me, first, Belanci at second. That is going to be a walk and another run. Three nothing Hillers. Hopkinton added five more in the second inning. Judd deals. And this is hit in the air over to left center. That's going to drop in for a base hit. Katie Hawley around to score. Sivo is going to come around. And it's a 7-0 lead for the Hopkinton Hillers. A two RBI hit for Bella Ansi. And three more in the third inning. Loaded up the bases once again for the Hillers. As this one's tattooed up the middle, that'll drop in for a hit. Emily Whalen around the score. Following her is Katie Holly. It may be a third run here. Here comes Emma Murphy, the throw in, not in time. And it's a three RBI base hit from Jill Cedia. 11 to nothing, Hopkinton. The Hillers girls would get the Mercy win with another run in the bottom of the sixth. Hopkinton takes down Westwood 12 to nothing and improves to four and one on the season. Westwood falls to 0 and five overall. Katie Holly was great from the pitcher circle, giving up no runs, two hits, and striking out a pair. Hillers baseball took care of business against Westwood in their home opener. Hopkinton won the game two to one. Brendan Kelly pitched a solid five innings, giving up two runs and one hit. Andrew Sirocco pitched two clean innings to close out the game and grab the W. Hillers won the game via a walk-off in the bottom of the seventh. Tommy Ambersoni got the winning hit and RBI. The Hillers followed up with a second straight home walk-off win Wednesday, May 2nd. After trailing 4-1 heading to the bottom of the seventh, the Hillers rallied and played it a walk-off run in the bottom of the ninth to take the 5-4 victory over Norton and improve to five wins and three losses on the season. A big thank you to Richard Sosicki for the excellent pictures.